Tonight, more snow is on the way there. Another winter storm rolling through Utah and paving the way for the start of the ski season. That's right. There's still several weeks to go before the results, the result, resorts open, but that's not stopping local skiers and snowboarders from making their own fun in the backcountry. New specials Alex Cabrero joins us now live at the base of Big Cottonwood Canyon. And Alex, even a little bit of snow here is a big deal to them. Oh, yeah, you know, to be young again, right, Dan? What am I talking about? We're still young, but we're here talking about the snow. And yes, whenever there's snow, usually we see some skiers and snowboarders enjoying the backcountry. Now, here along the mountains here, yes, there is some snow up there in the higher elevations, and more is expected with the storm coming in tonight. We went to the top of Big Cottonwood Canyon here, wondering if people might be out skiing or snowboarding, even with just a little bit of snow. We were surprised at how many people we found. There's something to be said about dedication, about doing whatever it takes to do what you love. I love it more than anything, man. It's like my favorite thing to do. Van Hackett and his buddy know that ski resorts aren't open just yet in Utah, but there is some snow on the ground, and for them, where there's snow, Be back, baby, with peso. there's opportunity for some fun. My whole life I've done this, so I don't really know what it's like to not. <laughs> which is why digging some early season snow to do some runs felt normal. It's just fun to get up here and do whatever we can. Their run at Brighton, a big cottonwood canyon, couldn't have been more than 100 feet long. If that. <laughs> but it didn't matter. I've been thinking about snow for like or skiing for a few months now, getting excited, so I was happy to be out here. There were quite a few others who were also excited about the snow, making their own runs and jumps. Even though much of the snow right now at the resort is artificial, people kept showing up. Excited, you could almost hear the lift lines and feel the cold air. Yeah, nothing better. And with the winter storm expected overnight, it only means more snow and opening day a little bit closer. Yeah, I can't wait. I'm counting down the days. Yeah, in fact, Brighton was just named one of the top 25 ski resorts in North America by Ski Magazine. Snow Basin was number one on that list, and there are several other Utah resorts on that list as well. Our partners with the Deseret News did a story on that list, and they have that posted online if you wanted to check it out at this time as well. But, you know, Dan and Debbie, I think for those people that we spoke with today up there, any resort that has a, even just a little bit of snow, that's the number one resort in their hearts right now, and more snow is coming. <laughs> yes, it is. Okay, Alex, thanks so much for that report tonight. All right.